too. Oh. <laughs> yes! Oh! Oh! oh. Jack! Football is known as the beautiful game thanks to players like Lee Trundle. He became one of the EFL's most iconic players thanks to a highlight reel of roulettes, spectacular goals and cheeky chips across his career spanning over 600 matches. The maestro is best remembered for his spell at Swansea City where he became a legend on the white side of South Wales. So, at the League of 72, we sent the artist back to his former canvas where he met up with current stars Olivier Encham and Liam Walsh to find out if the magic is still in those boots. This is Still Got It. We so saw who are the big characters in the dressing room at the moment. I'd say our characters, there's there's a lot of characters, but everyone's, everyone's in, like their individual character. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of different players. Who would the Joker be then? I'd say the Joker, probably say Rhino. Yeah. Yeah. Rhino's probably like, doesn't know all the little pranks and stuff like that. But then, like I said, like every, like there's a lot of players who are loud, always like planning on doing stuff, always having a laugh in it. Yeah. And obviously you need that, don't you? So it helps your team. Right, boys, we'll start off with a few of my skills. We'll see a couple of them here. So we'll see if you have got it and if I've still got it. So we'll start with the back to goal flip flap. Ollie, you can be the defender. Yep. Well, should you play it into me and I'll do that and then we'll swap over. Um, Rolling back the days, lad. Nice. Finish. Yes! Great finish. Well, reversed it. What's that? I thought you finished as well. No, I checked it and it went just past the Oh, yeah, you checked it. But he always crossed it. He always crossed it. Yes! So this one we're going to do a shoulder roll, probably one that everyone that talks to me about if ever a go places, this would be the, the trick that they mentioned, so we'll start with that. <laughs> <laughs> Chest is too big now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh. Got the skill though. Yeah. Still got the skill. Yes. Yes. Nice, Ollie. Oh, nice, great strike. Yes. Well done, yes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah. Unlucky. He, he was on though, he was off, wasn't I'm he? I'm only caught out the last second. Who would you say the most skillful player is in the squad now? I'd say this fellow. Yeah, I'd say he was up there, yeah. yeah. He's probably the only one who really expresses himself that much on the pitch. I think that's because the game's changing now as well, though. I reckon so, because like I said before, we were talking about it earlier on about players nowadays. Um, what they'd be like back in your day when you were playing, and what, what like the likes of you, you would be like in our day playing. But um, what do you reckon the standard would be like for the players See, that you played with and against? And I, I think always back in your days, it was more skillful player yeah. than now. Now it's more, not tactical, but it's more... But I think now there's a lot more on possession and yeah. a lot more how you keep the ball and how you build as a team rather than like individual flair. So I think now the way the game's played, I don't know whether my type would fit in because there'd be times where I would lose the ball trying to do something. And these days it's like you've got to you've got to keep the ball because you you know you work so much on a team. So mine would just go out and play and I was lucky enough that I had managers where if I lost the ball, he'd just say to me, get back in a space where when we win it back, we can get it back to you. Yeah. So it was never like go and chase him down or chase him down. So I don't know how I would have worked. Obviously I would have had to adapt the game, but still yeah. it would have been hard for a player like me to, yeah. to go and do that. Do you think you would have played as much games as you did? Nowadays, as you did back I'd then? Probably, probably not. It depends, doesn't it? Because if, you if you're still doing bits and scoring goals, well, you've got to, you'll stay in the side as a striker. But then would you be used more as, well, where they call it a luxury player, where they bring you on last 20 minutes if you need to get a goal or when, it's, when they need to take a chance? That could have been a role that they, they would have picked for me then. Oh, yeah, I agree. Going back to the most skillful player with Oli, playing against him, it's, it's, his feet are too quick, you know what I mean? You, you, yeah. you don't, some players, you, you do go and take that chance to go and take the ball off them. But even when he's got the back to you, he's always moving the ball, looking up as well. Yeah. Always doing the odd pass that you don't think he'll do. So 
Well, but, um, that's the that's the thing with me. I would I'd feel I feel more comfortable with me back to goal, where people can't see me because I yeah. wasn't quick. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I was never going to get the ball and, and run, run someone. Yeah. Mine would be more in areas like Spice this where I just got to yeah. get the feet to get a to get a shot get off a shot like that. So back to goal would probably be where I would feel most dangerous. Yeah. Well, we'll go into the penalty, which was the one where I've pretended to fix the ball back uh, and then, us, then took the penalty. So I'll I'll Genius show us. Times, like, huh, for you find this one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you seen this as well, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Goals to fix it. Tell me. Oh, it was just... <laughs> <laughs> I went back with that, was it? No, <laughs> but that one, I would always go, I would always go like with the toe, toe punt to try and get as much power on it as yeah. I could. So you, you, you want to, do you want to go, Al? Have yeah, a... I'll try it. Fix the ball first and then <laughs> this is a swing. <laughs> Straight back swing. Ah, right, right. oh, Ollie. He's, he's hard, isn't it? Huh? He's I hard, isn't it? I think it's hard it? to get the power, though, no? Yeah. It is. It's like someone yours, it's when you bend down, I try and do it in Because he's swinging the shot and yours is a little bang. <laughs> <laughs> he's hard, isn't it? Huh? He's hard, isn't it? Do you say to him, no, wait, sit, like, wait to the ref? Like, I'd put my hand as though I'm waiting. Like, as soon as he blows the whistle, then I would go as though I'm fixing Like, put my hand up as though I'm fixing it. Go to fix it. Yeah. <laughs> is this? Yeah, so I'll try again. I think the hard part is when you're getting hit, if you yeah. try and pull back to That's go, what it so you've got to go in, yeah. in one action. You didn't pull back on it, did you? No, so I'd go as soon as, as, soon as I'm go. Oh, a bang. Yeah. Walk away. <laughs> yeah, still there. Uh, can't get the height up. Yeah, it's hard on the... Uh, toes killing as well. I think obviously when we talk about tricks and everything, you watch people from like years ago and like I'd watch players. Gaza was one of mine and I robbed it off Gaza, but he'd done it as yeah. where he was going pretending to pick the ball up and he'd kick it and walk as though he was picking yeah. it up and he kept on hitting it with yeah. his foot. And then I then thought, well, I could do that on a penalty and that's when yeah. I gave it a go and, and tried that. Have any of you been penalty takers over your career? Yes. When I, when I was playing uh, in Celtic, it was the final of the cup against Rangers, and I took the penalty and I scored. Yeah. Good was, game to score then yeah, as well. Yeah, good game. Good game. Yeah, what game score, score did that make it? 1-0. Oh, nice. Yeah, a lot of pressure game. then on yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. And it was, a, it was a good game to play, good atmosphere, good fun. It was just crazy. Recreating some goals. This one was against Yeovil. It was the first night game at the, at the stadium. We won the game 2-0, so this was my... Second of the game, I scored a penalty first half as well. So we'll recreate this one and see how we get on. So chest, favourite one of mine, and then half volley over the keeper's head. You know what you were doing straight away, didn't you? Yeah. yeah. Huh. Oh! Oh, he's the nasty. Oh, that was the one thing, eh? Yes! Right, boys, I've done that in one goal, so I'll give you two <laughs> goals each. Two goals, yeah. Oh, they broke me for some that Oh, oh! What I mean, if you to get that touchdown from your chest, perfect so onto your left. Yeah. yeah, with the one bounce, and then it's a. Yes, yes. Ollie. Yes. And I think the other thing as well, it's like when you've got a defender closing you down, he makes your mind up that you've got yeah, it yeah, yeah, that time rather it. than yeah. taking it and waiting. Nah, go on, I've, I've got to do it now, haven't I? Can't not do it. Yes. Yes. Good finish. First time as well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So we're going to my favourite goal. This was at the Millennium Stadium in the Johnson's Peak Trophy final. It was uh, Leon Britton crossed the ball over from the right hand side and mine was a chest and volley. So we'll try and recreate that one now and see how we get on. Oh. Oh. Yes! Yeah. Come on! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> right, boys, so I showed you how it's done there. Yeah. So let's see if you have got it. Oh. Oh. Oh, does that touch that you do? Yeah, it's... To bring it away and then, is it? Yeah, they're allowed to bounce it, aren't they? That's how I do the fall. Oh, you, you do that with one? 
Oh, my God. Oh, I'm lucky. It's an old bounce, isn't it? It's not bad. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's us. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, I tested you there. Oh! oh. <laughs> 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 Great finish. This should have done it, dog. <laughs> That was the hardest one. Yes. I've had you off again there, haven't I? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> See, you make them work a bit, they come up with the goods. Not quite like it was ours, but. No, it was <laughs> good finishes. Right, boys, we've recreated a couple of mine. Now, all we're going to do one of yours. Take us through that. So, this goalie was the goal against Luton. We was losing 3 nil, I think, in the first half, and it was a tough game a little bit, and we come back 3-3. Three, three. Just instinct? Just instinct, yeah. I think, yeah. And I'm always shooting outside the box, so it's just feeling to do it. Yeah, brilliant. Let's give it a go, then. <laughs> I think it's harder trying to recreate, because you've got to hit it yeah. in a certain place. Yeah, because it's cold, it's different. Yeah. Oh, wrong side. Oh! oh. <laughs> what a finish. Yeah, that was exactly like it. Yeah, that was, <laughs> that was the same. That was the great same. finish. The worst thing is, Dan, when you make all these great saves, they'll be cut out. <laughs> <laughs> they just think every shot's gone past you. Don't see your saves. <sighs> right, but a lot harder than it looks, that one all, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Boys, great technique today. Thanks for showing us that you've definitely got it and have enjoyed the afternoon. Dan, I hope you've got nothing planned tonight, mate, because we're staying here till I've scored. Good session, Dan. Thanks for letting theirs in, mate. That'll do their confidence the world of good.